spaghetti-o. I said, uh-oh, spaghetti-o. Holy guacamole. That boy Tom McDonald getting slammed against the wall. That boy Tom McDonald back is against the wall, ain't he? And look, we finna talk about it today because you know what? I'm so sick and tired of you damn hangover world. What's y'all name? Hangover. Listen here, hangover world. Tom is finna take this L. We finna go down the timeline today, all right? Tom has been getting bodied and Tom is running from the smoke. Now, we're waiting on you, Tom. Okay, guys? We're waiting on Tom McDonald. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Look, look, hangover land. I told y'all as before. What's y'all name? Hangover world? Y'all need to listen here, all right? Tom McDonald's just gonna have to take this L in 24. Now, for everybody who's been here since day one, and I do mean day one, a couple years ago, I was online and I stumbled across this raggedy ass motherfucker named Tom McDonald, right? It's lately this nation is so ashamed and hating itself. Did everyone forget that people died to pay for this ungratefulness? United States gave everything to you just to help. I just wanna sell. Shut your ass the hell up, Mr. McDonald. I'm about to turn this bullshit fake ass Eminem shit off. If you don't sit your G.I. Joe, mash Mr. Army Man ass down somewhere and take your ass back to the Army, you fake ass Machine Gun Kelly ass wannabe ass. Let me shut up because I'm telling you, you know me. Y'all know me. My subscribers know I don't hold back. And if you got a problem, come on with it, mother sucker. Because I'm I'm ready to fight motherfuckers on YouTube. Ah, 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 ah. You want some? Come and get it. But this bullshit he talking about, he need to st Donald Trump nephew need to sit his ass down. Yo, 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 uncle is no longer the president. Sit your ass down. Now, I gave Tom McDonald a chance. I have went down Tom McDonald's whole catalog. I have tried to give this man a chance. It is the same tune, the same song. Every single time, dog. We gonna talk about it today, okay? We gonna get down to it. I just, I just, I just, I, I just have to get. We we have to get that. Look, pal. Hey, bud. Look, don't get your panties in a bunch there, bud. All right. Look, I know, bud. The truth, when the truth comes out, bud, it's not always a good thing. Hey, pal. I know how you feel. Look, if I was a part of the hangover world, I'd pull my hair out right now, too. I can see you punching holes in your wall. You're angry because what we said about Tom on the Internet. But guess what there, bud? I don't give a damn because Tom McDonald get his ass slung right now. Tom McDonald is losing three to zero to up church. That, that's the first thing I'm going to point out. Okay, y'all told me that Tom McDonald is the best independent artist in the game rap artist y'all said tom mcdonald is the best rapper alive and i said oh my god oh i don't think tom mcdonald is the best rapper at all period now y'all told me y'all did say this right y'all said tom mcdonald was the best rapper alive right yet he keeps making these wacky weirdo political American parody songs this American political bull crap and, and y'all are going for it if you guys gonna have to start seeing this dude for who he is okay let's put it this is what we're gonna do because we're gonna break this down today a lot of people don't want to put Tom McDonald under a microscope alright so Tom McDonald has a song called Facts let's go ahead and point out some facts so first, we're going to go down the timeline. This is really ridiculous because, look, bud, I know, okay? Stop turning so red, all right? I know you're angry. I know you're mad, pal. But guess what, bud? I don't give a damn, boy. And I hope you break your laptop watching this shit because y'all got to stop jumping in front of 18-wheeler moving trucks for Tom McDonald, dog. If Tom McDonald told y'all to jump off a bridge on his next album, you're not going to be here for the next one. Because <laughs> when Tom say jump, y'all be like, how high? How high, Tom? <laughs> because we're way up. We don't never look down. Tom, and this is another thing. First of all, this is what we're going to do. Before we get started on how Tom McDonald got his ass bodied by Upchurch three times in a row, and he did not 
even want to entertain the rap beat lets me know that he's scared to rap and compete on the mic, okay? Let's just state that right there because we gonna point out the facts. We gonna get into that whole Upchurch topic. Now. But before we even get into that, you hangover land people, look buddy, look, I think you had a little bit too much booze to drink and it's time to go to bed. You know how you hangover guys get. You drink all that booze and start walking around telling people that Tom McDonald is better than every rapper alive. Oh my God. What is in your bottle, goddamn? That motherfucker drinking rubbing alcohol. <laughs> it's the hangover land. Oh, y'all looking lame as hell. Hangover land? What is that, dog? It's not hangover land. Look, somebody said, it's not hangover land. It's hangover gang. Get it right, pal. Get it right. Oh, man. Y'all have got to be. Okay, so here's another thing I want to know right now. Okay. Why does Tom McDonald keep on lying about the Billboard charts, dog? That shit's got to be. Like, come on, dog. That's embarrassing. You're getting on YouTube. First of all, you're telling people that you are number and i'm trying to say this with a straight face but I, I almost bust out laughing i almost had an outburst all right because when i listen to tom Duncan, look guys i'm just gonna be honest with you when i listen to tom mcdonald it, i have an outburst it gives me it gives me the giggles because this shit is pretty goddamn funny guys and we're gonna talk about it look okay tom mcdonald gets on the internet and begs you guys to please guys we're trying to fight america not only are we fighting america we're fighting itunes it's the itunes conspiracy they're trying to make me number nine and knock me to it's a it's a itunes conspiracy guys they're saying i'm not number one they're cheating the numbers the robots are taking over we gotta fight technology guys itunes let me tell you all something guys itunes and spotify are stealing all my views and they're trying to cheat me they're trying to cheat the system so i need everybody to go out and buy my cd my new american stars and stripes and banners <laughs> my on friday is coming out everybody go get the cd cd this motherfucker still dropping cds that's number one we're waiting for your response tom mcdonald okay we're waiting for your response because this is how this goes tom mcdonald wants to sit up here and lie okay we're waiting for your response because you're sitting up here and you're saying you're number one on the billboard. This is what I want to know. Tom McDonald says he's number one on the billboard chart, right? Do y'all know that Taylor Swift just came out with a new album? Future and Metro Boomin just came out with a new album. Drake just dropped something. And you mean to tell me that Tom McDonald has more streams and more online sales then Taylor Swift, Future, Metro, and Boomin, and Drake, all three of them, <laughs> give me that goddamn crack pipe. Just say no, okay? Goddamn. Is Tom McDonald sending you, is Tom McDonald sending you guys crack with these CDs? <laughs> is Tom McDonald, or is he sending you some type of special drugs when y'all are buying these CDs? Who buys CDs? Bottom line, let's get down to it, guys. Now, today, we're going to talk about how Tom McDonald got his ass kicked, right? So, this has been going on now for about two months, and Tom McDonald still hasn't came back. But he has managed to come out with what? Some whack-ass songs. Up Church drops the first disc, which was Y Boys. My boys, my boys, find out what the South know. Somebody tell transgender Hannah Montana to take his maple syrup sipping ass back over to fucking Canada. Green goblin looking honky, only known when in the web. Hashtag America Hummer, bullet, bulletproof vest. You ain't going now, solid out your COVID 19 message. Where he called Tom McDonald a maple syrup sipping ass nigga. He called him a bedazzled Power Ranger. He talked bad about Tom McDonald. Okay, that was the first one. Then he came out with a Tom McDonald diss number two, right? Screaming white boy a couple of times, now he automatically thinks we friends. Leave a hog at the farm and the deceased in my big pen. Got marked with an ink tip, I'm real bored. Flip trick, my style make a trick flip. Is that Katie no L or a revamp of white chick? Transform rappers into looking like my side pit. I be standing in the kitchen eating Canadian bacon strips. And ain't nobody on my wave, so nobody can sink the ship. Hey. Tom McDonald still didn't respond, dog. 
Okay, Tom McDonald still didn't respond. And y'all got to cut this shit out. Tom McDonald doesn't look down. Tom McDonald never looks down. Tom McDonald doesn't look down. Motherfucker, Tom McDonald need to look up. Because right now, Tom McDonald is at the bottom of the goddamn barrel. Okay, and we don't take Tom McDonald serious. I don't take Tom McDonald serious. And y'all got to cut this shit out. This Tom McDonald is, he has the number one, the number one record in the world. Tom McDonald is the number one artist in the country. Not in the country. And then Tom McDonald will get on here and lie to y'all and be like, hey guys, we made it to number one. We got the number one song in the world. And you fucking wacky ass weirdos are going to get here on my page and try to rip me apart talking about how Tom is number one. We know damn well he didn't outsell Taylor Swift. And then what did Tom come out with? He came out with that wacky ass motherfucking song. God mode. But not only did he come out with God mode, he came out with, with some whack ass shit before that. Instead of Tom fighting back, instead of Tom spitting some bars and responding to Upchurch, what did Tom McDonald come with? He dropped that wacky ass, weird ass, political ass song that he made from two years ago. He went to the goddamn trash bin and recycled his trash that he'd been making. The same political song after he got dissed twice by Upchurch, dog. He went and dropped a song from two years ago. How weak is that? Then he turned around and lied, talking about he's number one on the Billboard charts. He outsold Drake, Future. He's outselling everybody, dog. He even outsold Ice Spice, all of them, dog. He said he's outselling everybody in the music industry right, right now. He's bigger than everybody out. The nigga's outselling Jack Harlow. He's outselling everybody. Oh, my God. <laughs> ah, y'all got to stop this shit, dog. This shit got to stop. So we went down the timeline. Tom McDonald came out with that wacky-ass political song from two years ago. Then Upchurch hit him with the nail in the coffin, and he came out. What did he come out with, guys? He came out with the Upchurch Push-Ups remix. Who playing this through paying for Ukrainians to listen? Now they in their feelings because I don't never sit to listen in. Stop attending you motherfuckers of life living. You light them and you're spending your night minutes. Destroying your sight vision. Get a night light for your lame gimmick lines. Brain mimicking the same rhythm every single time. Al Gore of algorithm saying something doing different. Don't know where to fit in. Tried every outfit and fitted. This not a level of realm and for you it's restricted. Because you out chasing them dollars like a rural town stripper. Holy locks from Canada but this that down south shit. Who's the proper? That you throwing as a niche. I'ma feed it back to your one hand and a dick. I'm so far flame every dish remembered like it's Auschwitz. So Tom McDonald got dissed. He came out with that political ass song from two years ago. Then he turned around and came out with God mode. Sorry ass God mode. A, a song that was eight minutes and what Jesus. A whole cinematic film. We this nigga gave us a whole sitcom a demon sitcom was talking about raw this is america i was eating he was talking about he had crackheads and shit everywhere and he, he said remember he came out with a song that was eight minutes 24 seconds he was talking about how he was chasing his friend down because his friend was addicted to crack he got addicted to the crack rock and tom was like stop no stop doing crack and tom was going to the church and he was eating boiled eggs and drinking kool-aid and he had crackheads knocking on his window was what kind of what kind of ghetto in Canada was that? Ooh, this motherfucker Tom was living in the ghetto in Canada. Damn. You had crack. I was living in Compton, man. Tom, what in the fuck was you doing in the hood? You was a whole smoker. Look, this dude is not real, dog. Tom is fake. Tom ain't got no bars. Tom didn't got bodied on the mic. He didn't got bodied by King Judd. I can body Tom McDonald. If I can body Tom McDonald, that means anybody can, bro. Like, y'all, you know what I'm saying? Like, Tom, and let's just be real. Tom McDonald been running from the smoke for a long time, dog. Tom McDonald got bodied by Mac Lethal. He lost that battle. And ever since he battled Mac Lethal, well, he tried to. But let's just be real, dog. Those G.I. Joe American knowing this half the battle last songs that Tom McDonald's making ain't going to cut it. And y'all have to cut this shit out talking about some Tom McDonald has the number one record. Tom McDonald has the number one record on Mars. Even aliens are buying the new Tom McDonald God mode. Tom McDonald is so popular 
that he is making sales on Mars. They're listening to Tom right now in spaceships right now. They're up in a whole nother universe right now listening to Tom. This music, that's why we don't look down, because we're on a whole nother stratosphere. Tom McDowell not only is number one on the Billboard charts, Tom is his own independent artist. Tom does everything. He's way up in the clouds, all right? And we're not worried about no goddamn up church, man. All right? God, okay, we're way up here on the mountain. We're not looking down. So what? So what if Tom is using artificial intelligence to create his rhymes, right? We don't care, right? Tom is the greatest, even though he's not American. We still love Tom, and he's the greatest American ever. That's how y'all be sounding. And look, y'all gonna hold this L hangover. Listen, hangover world. Hey, buddy. Look, pal, you're just gonna have to hold it. Look, go ahead. Go on with that L, bud. There you go. I'm nah, 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 it's your L. Because Tom McDonald get his ass kicked. Tom McDonald's not going to respond. And stop making these excuses talking about Tom is too big to respond. Tom is at the bottom of the fucking charts, bro. Nobody knows who fucking Tom McDonald is. We know who old McDonald is, E-I-E-I-O. <laughs> and that's what this shit be sounding like. The same tune over and over again. America sucks. He's going to bash people. But I'm just going to tell you right now. I'm going to expose Tom. All you hangover land people, y'all really don't want no smoke. I know you got a hangover. But don't come over here to my channel trying to troll me because y'all are taking an L. Look, you're super drunk right now. You keep on stumbling and falling down. <laughs> All right, you need to put the bottle down. And uh, just put it this way. We know that Tom's not better than Eminem. We know that. We know Tom is a rinky-dink, fake-ass WWE wrestler trying to rap. <laughs> so y'all can take that shit, put it in your pipe and smoke it. Up Church won the battle. I told y'all I was going to give Tom till this weekend to respond. Tom McDonald drops videos every Friday, right? When he comes out, Tom McDonald jumps on Fridays, right? Every time Tom McDonald comes out, he comes out on a Friday, right? Now this Friday just passed and Tom McDonald didn't defend himself. He wants to defend a country he's not even from. And talk about, he's not even defending the country. He's really insulting America. He's an insult to the United States of America. And Tom McDonald's a piece of shit. Tom McDonald really can't rap like that. He really not built like that. He really don't want no smoke. You know what I'm saying? And I didn't buy the Tom McDonald. Tom McDonald ain't shit, bro. That's light work. Let's look. The moral of the story, in conclusion, Tom McDonald lost. He's not going to respond. Please don't come to my page trying to troll my page talking about how great Tom McDonald is and that he doesn't look down because right now he is down. And he's not winning. He's not lyrical. He ain't got no bars like that. He's got to make these eight minute and 24 second. Rawr, rawr, I'm poor. I was, ah, I was hurt. I was eating eggs. We don't want to hear that shit. America. Ah, stop. Yes, America's horrible. Everybody's walking around the transgender. The gas prices are high. Fuck Joe Biden. Uh, and we got the liberals and everybody's woke. But uh, we don't want to hear that shit no more, Tom. You've been doing that shit for like three years now, bro. And we know that's your lane. We know that's the only thing that helped you get to where you're at now is you had to use the fucking political Republican Party over there who's supporting you. You might as well go ahead and run for office, but nobody's going to vote for you with all them wacky ass tattoos on your face. And you really don't care about America. You can't get involved with the system because nobody's going to take you serious because you look like an old ass school desk that's been carved and written on. And nobody's going to take you serious with them twisty braids. All right, Tom. And you got twisty braids and you're walking around with a Canadian accent trying to be a nigga in the streets. And it's just not going to work for you. OK. All right. Just give it up. All right, Tom, you got body by up church. I think this might be the end of Tom because I'm just going to be honest. I don't know about you guys, but I'm tired of that wacky, weirdo ass American shit he's trying to create with the roar. I'm a deep roar. I'm a monster. Look, look at my spooky contacts. Oh, that's pretty cool, isn't it? No, it's not. You know what I'm saying? But I'm going to tell you right now, it's your boy King Judd, and I might just be. No, fuck that. I am the most underrated YouTuber and the most talented, entertaining YouTuber of all time. Take it how you want to take it. But just know this. It takes no sense to make no sense. And a lot of y'all ain't making no sense. And I got to go. I'll holler at you later.